There's no fucking way. Welcome in to the morning of day 13 of finding the bomb. What uh what a cluster this morning was or last night I may say. We had as you can tell we're on the roof. We're a little we've been a little scared all night. Um what well, this I don't know if it's being this close to the wasteland or just the way things are, but we had a bunch of things crafting last night because why not? We got to get moving. We had a Screamer Horde show up. Um, not only did we have one Screamer, but we had three Screamers. And they called in a bunch. And they came to the house, and it was not trick-or-treat time, and I was not prepared. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, I've uh, put us up a little like this. A little, little balcony area with some, uh, some goodness on there. I forgot how big these dew collectors are. They're three by three squares. They're huge. Anyway, um, look at all the goodness. Look at this. Look how much cobblestone we have. So much cobblestone. Look how much cement we have. Not a whole lot. I don't know what else to do about that. We're crafting this down right now. We'll take this. We'll make some more. Put that on the craft. Um, duct tape. I took duct tape for quad pocket mods. I think I can only... Oh, I can make two. Okay, so we are going to... Hold on. Let me double check something here. Triple in there. Triple in there. Triple in there. Nothing in there. Uh... That gives us only two extra spaces for how much? Oh, that takes legendary parts. We're going to pause on that. We're going to pause on that. I got really excited for a little bit. Okay, I've got some spikes. I have some doors because I think I'm going to use some doors for yield uh, trap base that we got going on. We need something to be able to run across, and I feel like that's going to be uh, the best thing we can do is make our own personal draw bridges. Um, I need more animal fat. I need much, much more animal fat to be able to keep crafting sham. Trader reset today. We're going to take a peek at him. I'm going to get down there now. I want to start paying attention to things that are going on around this world. Um, I want to see what he has available, and I want to start working on the base now. I want to try and get some of my upgrades and some of my design ideas down before we get too locked into place. Okay, first and foremost... I do not think just this regular step set like this is going to be the key. I think there's going to be too many zombies that are going to beat on this. I think what I'm going to need to do is make a ooh, like a legitimate path. I think we're going to need to go out here and like this. Brain is working, but it is working slow. I need to have enough space that I can make this open up a little bit. Because I need to have the zombies not beat on their only path up to us. They jump up here. They come here. Then they come up to us here. And then what I think I'll do is scaffolding. And like that. And then, if I'm not mistaken, all we need to have is the pull double. Like that. And that should keep us from having any zombies get through. I think I need to go one more up like this. Which is okay. It's not a big deal. Uh, copy, shipping, rotation. Over here. 
That's fine. Because what I need to do is I need to get enough of a block on top here that I can block myself off from the vultures. This little thing here is not going to be a big issue. We're not going to have any real sets with that. Because I need this. Just to keep them from... From pushing up and getting over on the top. And as long as they just bonk, they come straight up to there. Now... I feel like I'm going to need... I want to do a ramp here. Give them a sweet path. And then the jump here. Because even if... Mm, I might need the double ramp. I don't want them getting hung up. I want them to make a clear path that they won't get stuck on. Okay. So follow me here. Follow me here. Follow me here. If we can get them to run across a thin pole like that, that might give us enough space to work with them falling down. Shapes. I just want to... I want to try and get them pathing in a position where it's going to be easiest for them to come up run and then if they fall through here no big deal they're going to start down at the bottom and that could be a possibility i know we wasted a lot of material on this but i think that this is going to be the right call i think this is going to be the right call i'm not going to upgrade the poles just yet because i need to find out if those even work I need to find a zombie here pretty soon. Okay. Um, zombie. Can I get one help? Just one. Just one straggler floating around literally anywhere. Literally anyone. Morning, Joel. Have you seen any zombies? You're open from sunrise to sundown. What can I do for you? I just, I'm looking for some friends. Unless you want to get out from behind this counter and come help me real quick. I'd appreciate that. Uh, fetching clear. If you like coin as much now that we'll we take are that for business right now. partners, step what do you right got? up and let's find you the perfect fit. Let me just slow down here, bud. I need you to just take a moment to breathe. Joel, I'm not seeing, ooh, steel shovel for five though. Mm hmm. My sir. Oh my god, you're selling the club. Look at the difference in that. Oh, and an SMG. Oh, generator. We could set up traps. Steel club, though. My god, sir. Okay. Now, I know you're going to need some armor, so you should reconsider. Yes, I will. I will absolutely reconsider, but what I'm also thinking... What's today? Today is the 13th. Tomorrow, maybe we do the loops. Is there? Do you think there's another trader on the other side of this town? If a kilometer out gave us another town, right? Like this wasn't a kilometer. I don't think. Do you think that there's another Joel at the top of this town somewhere. Um, let's see. Let's do. Let's do stairs here, I think, is what we should do. We should do a set of stairs that go up. The stairs are going to be a little bit more slow down, but the ramps are going to be pretty good. I think that that's fine. We'll get a little bit of aesthetics going here. Let's see if we can also keep them from beating on this. If they break these stairs, if they get hung up and break these stairs, we may... Ugh. I want to go maybe one more out, I think. Even if we just do that, let's give them all the stairs we possibly can. I don't want to overshoot some of our material. That should give them enough reason not to get hung up, and then they can come and push up all the way on there. That that should be 
That should be fine. That's that's good enough for me. I'm gonna do this cement now, just so I don't have to worry about it later. Supposedly, it's like a corridor for the zombies. They'll run up the middle of it, but if they do get hung up on anything, they'll just beat on this versus the rest of the stairs. I don't know. We'll leave that for right now. We could potentially put a sledgy off the side here and bonk them back down. I kind of... Mm, I don't know. I didn't mean to upgrade that, but we're already here. We'll just make sure we go straight up for that. Ugh. See, that jump there, that's going to be so hard for us to get to. There's no way. If we if we botch that jump, we're on the ground with the zombies. And I am notorious for making bad plays like that. Yeah, that's not so bad. So that way I can open it up to throw stuff. I mean, it doesn't really matter from here. They're not going to really beat around the side of this. Because they're going to be coming straight for the front. All right, now this is what I'm thinking. And I'm not thinking very well here. Um, um, advanced rotation. Can I put this right here without you falling? I can. When this is open, the zombies won't see that as a path. But that'll give me enough space to jump. Oh, I can't hit it from there, though, can I? But I can walk on the side of that. Am I going to be able to do this in the heat of battle? You know what I mean? Because what I'd like to do, realistically... Oh! Damn it. That's a wasted door. Okay, I'm not, I'm not mad about this so far. So, this isn't a bad jump. We can get to here. Drop the door. Get back over to our next landing. Zombies should see that as the path and fall down, but then we're kind of blocked here. I don't want to be blocked by this, so maybe we do that. Oh! Care package! Don't they? I don't even see you. Hello? What? Where? Where did that go? Hello? There's a dog. I don't see the care package at all. Okay, puppy, can I get your attention real quick, bud? Am I... Am I not hitting you? Hello? Dog! All right, that dog. Oh, wait, here we go. Hi, bud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Come here. Are you going to make it across? Oh, you are. Oh, God, you are. Everything about that is so much better than I thought it was going to be. Definitely pathed up through here. Okay. We might be okay. We might be okay. How quickly the zombies chewed through uh, the wood on a day seven horde. I think minimal everything needs to be cobblestone. Um, are we going to have enough for all that? I'm not 100% sure. I'm stressing out like it's already a horde night, you know? It's, we've got a whole day left over. But if I don't do this... I know I'm going to miss something. I know we're going to have problems. Right? Right here. This fighting path in itself. I need to go cement all the way up through here. We really just don't have a whole lot of cement. We need to pay attention to this. Our goal needs to be making as much cement as humanly possible. I would like to cobble some up here. Maybe even potentially cement. I think the pillars need to be cement. 
at least too high because if zombies are going to go into rage mode i want at least too high all the way across for them to do their cement beating and then move on with their lives the walkway here can't collapse or it breaks the whole pathing and then i'll probably reinforce this section here but the rest of this should be cool and then whatever our fighting position platform is here is probably going to be i'm going to go out maybe a couple more blocks I don't think we're going to get to that mission today. I don't want to necessarily get to that mission. We still have so much upgrading it's going to take. We're low on wood. We're low on all the rest of this. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and take a roll out real quick. I have, just looking at the size of this town, the way this goes, I want to go right here. I just... I got this feeling in my gut. This town and everything is so big that the likelihood that we'll have another trader up here is going to be huge. I mean, let's chill. Where the hell are all the zombies? Armor up books. Right? Oh, there's one. Oh, they just spawned in behind us. Okay. Oh, so now they're spawning in front of us. All right. Okay, we're taking uh, the worst back streets we can right now. Oh, okay. You guys are just fighting. Can we, can we get around here? We can totally get around here. Take that. Yep. Hello, sir. Oh, oh, oh. Did you see what I saw? Is that what I think it is? No, probably not, right? No, that can't be it. That'd be too damn convenient. Okay, well. Well, we have made some choices in life, and they are exactly what we didn't want to be doing. Okay, excuse me. I need to take all of you. I need to pick up the mini bike because we're dumb. Dumb as dicks. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? Just the way this whole loop looked over here. What did I tell you? Oh my god. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. That's... That's a power move right now. Hi! We've got armor and just about everything in here. Thank god. What can I get you? Well, armor. Greater Joel's let me see what you got. got. the gear to make it happen. What I need, sir is a damn book that is going to make my life a million times easier. I don't see it, though. You got a workbench in here. Okay, so you don't really have anything except for the strength mod. Which, honestly, is kind of cool. It just gives you one pet plus strength, right? That's what I'm saying. I think, I think that that's not a bad get. I think we could end up putting, like, multiple of these in multiple different armors and then just stack up okay so you don't have anything cool that i need okay but the no fact that you're to buy, here but is you might want cool. to consider your safety in the wasteland and buy at least one item hey joel nothing overly fantastic but i need to contend with some issues here actually you know it's not too bad Okay, I want to get on out of here. Oh, snake, though. I need that. I don't care about the rest of all of this. Give me the animal fat. Oh, you don't give me any animal fat. Hi, bear. Look at all the dead. Uh, okay, well, let's... Yeah, well, guys. Come on, wake up. you let me see the sports bag Shh, junk all right so jenny girl jenny's up here so it's either going to be this fat road that we cut off of or it's going to be this one and there'll be a wrap up up there somewhere um that's good though one two three joels all in the same area i mean that doesn't do great for us i really would rather have a hue for many reasons. But one of them would be just because Joel is also going to 
have, or not Joel, but he was going to have um, weapons. And I feel like that's going to be where we're going to find the mods and all the parts and everything that we're going to really need. Okay, I'm hoping this road here links up with the other road, and then we can take it all the way back down to our house. Ow! Oh. That was my bad. And it does. And it does. Okay. That's huge. Okay, perfect. So it does. So this road will take us all the way back down. We're not going to do our mission today. Um, unfortunate, but, you know, a little bit of exploring is, is not bad. Plus, we did a lot of base building today. Finding two Joels in the same city is huge. Let's see. What time is it? Let's get back home. Let's get... I need to get some more mining going because we need to get the cement up and crafting. We need as much cement as possible before tomorrow. I'm going to have to watch out for streamers. Um, but it's like the main goal I need to get to is just as much cement crafted so I can make that concrete so we can just be ready to rock. Sometimes seven days is just about the exploring. You know, it's not always got to be base building doesn't always have to be something crazy. You can take that moment to just ride around and kind of get an idea on what you got going on. And yeah, we blew through so much gas today. Oh, maybe getting the chem station is kind of the next goal, right? Like we're going to really need to, we're going to really need to, let's see, fill this up real quick. Yeah, there's just not a lot left. We only need five books. Okay, not bad. We'll just keep this. Um, I wish I could see what turning the next nerdy outfit, because we can make threes. I don't know if two to three is going to be the answer, but maybe two to four will be when we swap it out. Okay, how was our... Let me crouch real quick before the stream streamers come in. We've got two skill points to spend. Okay, we're going to go one point to agility. And one point to parkour. Parkour 2 is done. That gives us way better jumping ability. Reducing the fall damage. But the, the just being able to jump the 2 meters now. It's just. It makes things so much easier in the long run. Urban combat. It's literally the last book we need. It's literally the last book we need. And we're done with that. Okay. I can make an anvil and a bellows. What is the anvil? Advanced bellows. You'll take a couple minutes. We'll get the anvil up and running. We'll have ourselves moving and grooving a little bit more. I am going to, I think, hide in this closet for the remainder of the evening. So we don't spoop any, any uh, screamers. All right. Tomorrow, it's horde night. Finish up the base. Maybe we'll hit a couple missions. Cement is going to be the key. I got to... Oh, no. I actually have to mine tonight. Damn it. All right, who cares? We're going to make it happen. All right, guys, I'll catch you later. Bye.